You think your god cares what happens to you? We can do whatever we wish. Help! I need help! Please! Anyone! Way Filthy heretic! Filthy heretic! <laughs> Is that the last of them? I hope so. Still, best not to take any chances. I'll hurry home. Don't think I'll leave it again anytime soon, either. You've done me a kindness, young man. Be assured, I won't this forget it. Omen. Everything I have. My good people, your search has come to an end. I have anything anyone could possibly need. Welcome. I have everything you'll ever need. to be a true hero.
Do you understand? Yes. I am to deliver the letter to your merchant friend. And you know who to see? The same man as always. Do not think to betray my presence in this city. We have many eyes, many ears. And many arms, yes. Good for silencing those who say too much. I know this well. You have my word. Good. Then be quick about it. Time is short. Safety and peace, Altair. I trust you are looking for information to aid you in your strike against Tamir. I fear I have nothing to offer. But uh, Bahir might. He shouldn't be too far from here. The situation has not changed, brother. I still know nothing of Tamir. Where are you? The situation has not changed, brother. I still know nothing of Tamir. <laughs> Can anyone help me? You dare steal in my presence? That will cost you your life! Odd. Why would you do that? So they've sent you, eh? An interesting choice. Though not my place to judge. The Rafik has asked me to observe the souk that Tamir calls home. Here's what I have learned. There's a group of troublemakers who gather around its southeastern exit. They and the guards do not get along. Find a way to earn their friendship, and they'll surely be of service to you.
You won't believe your eyes. Why would anyone want to do that? Is there a reason for this nonsense? Could I interest you in this one? No? Well, there's more. Much more. Find his squares in all the land. I'm telling you, it's rats. No, it's children. I hear them laughing. Rats or children? Either way, it's bad for business. All that noise! Someone needs to get up on those beams and clear them out. I wonder how they're getting up there. Must be through the central courtyard. Then we should ask the guard to have a look. Ah, they're all much too busy polishing the backside of their master. Something? What is that man doing? Oh, my thief! Has he lost what have I done wrong? Tell me, please! Ah. The heretic! Ah. You're lying! Infidel, is... die! Yes! Ah. 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 For you to deliver a warning. Should Richard take Jaffa, there will be no stopping him. He will march on Jerusalem next. We must end this before it has a chance to begin. Why would he do that? That city is ours, has always been ours. And it is our duty to defend it until death. Has the crusader is going to hurt himself. I don't destroyed. understand what he's trying to accomplish. Praise be Salahadin! He has found the strength to stand in defense of our great civilization. Make no mistake, it is our very existence we are fighting for. The infidel king would see us all wiped from the world. Mm.
I have many things, many things, too many things. Why would he do that? Good day, my friend. If there's anything Strange, I can help I've you never with, seen someone do that all, before. Do you you want Is there a reason for him to do that? Die, thief! Hey! You look familiar! I'll have your life! You will die here! This now Merchant prince without peer. Was just before Hatim. The Saracens were low on food and in desperate need of resupply. But there was no relief in sight. And so Tamir left, riding north and wondering what would become of his supplies. For soon, they would surely spoil. That should have been the end of this tale, and the poor man's life. But fate intended otherwise. As Tamir drove his caravan north, he came across the Saracen leader and his starving men. Most fortunate for them both, each having something the other wanted. What do you want? Tamir drove a caravan in those days between Damas and Jerusalem. But recent business had been poor. It seemed there were none in Jerusalem who wanted what he had. Fruits and vegetables from nearby farms. None know the man better than I. Come close. Hear the tale I have to tell. Of a merchant prince without peer. As Tamir drove his caravan north, he came across the Saracen leader and his starving men. Most fortunate for them both, each having something the other wanted. Some say, were it not for Tamir, Salahadin's men would have surely turned on him. Could be we won the battle because of that man. You seem to know quite a bit about Tamir. Tell me what he's planning. I know only the stories I tell, nothing more. A pity. There's no reason to let you live if you've nothing to offer in return. Wait, wait! There is one thing. Continue. He is preoccupied as of late. He oversees the production of many, many weapons. What of it? They're meant for Salah ad-Din. This does not help me, which means it does not help you. No, stop, listen! Not Salah ad-Din. They're for someone else. The crests these arms bear, they are different, unfamiliar. It seems Tamir supports another, but I know not who. Is that all? Yes, yes. I've told you everything I know. Then it's time for you to rest. <laughs> oh, my God. 